Well, we realised last year with the popularity of uh, the last concert we did last on the 17th of December last year, um, we had so much kind of local support, so much noise, um, thankfully to the star, and that relationship has continued throughout this year and of course in the preparation for this year's concert which is looking like it's going to be even bigger and better. Um, and we had a local band on last year and we realised how important that was to uh, stress that, I know we're bringing in these big artists, but it's about Sheffield, It's about I'm from Sheffield, it's about affecting people's lives in Sheffield, you know the cancer charities are based here and uh, it was important um, last year to make sure that that message was kind of carried across. And it, and it really worked. So this year we kind of thought about it. I thought, well, well, look, why don't we give a local band an opportunity to be a part of this thing? And we pushed that even further and said, well, look, you know, with the profile we've built, why don't we give that local band an opportunity to come and work with me here in my studio um, and also perform with us on stage? So we've launched this competition called the Limelight Competition. Um, the idea is that local bands can enter and um, apply and basically have a chance to play on stage and come record here at the Steelworks. Well, you've got Elliot Kennedy, who's a Grammy Award winner with Aretha Franklin. He's wrote songs for Take That, uh, Brian Adams. He's wrote, wrote and produced with uh, Ronan Keating. So, you know, the, 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 uh, the talent and the connections and, and his achievements are endless. So, uh, you know, that, that's the sort of quality that you're, uh, that you're going to be working with. Sheffield's a major city in the country and uh, to have such a talented fella writer producer to be able to um, work with him uh, to, to, for him to look at your, your talents and record with him is, is phenomenal and you know we watch X Factor and uh, Britain's Got Talent and uh, such shows like this this is a massive opportunity for a local band um, they can send their MP3 and their gift aid certificate saying that they've, they've paid the, the, the entrance fee of £10 um, all the funds, every single penny from this thing goes to uh, Cavendish and Western Park. So it's a, it's a great cause anyway. But um, the, it's very simple. They enter online or they can post their CD. Uh, we're just looking for one song, a short biog, um, give us an insight into who the band are and what they're doing. Um, we will choose um, the best, the top dozen, and they'll go online. Um, and then from online, everybody uh, who reads the Star and goes online, watches the Star website, can then um, vote as to who their favourite band is. And the top five will go through to the final, which is to be held at the O2 Academy, I think on the 19th of November. And as it's the uh, look inside the, uh, the, the local paper, the Star, who's a great supporter of our, uh, our uh, event, and uh, there's going to be opportunities there to enter this competition and uh, you know what you want to be doing is not uh, not resting on your laurels you need to get in there and get in there quickly because these tickets are going to get snapped up these opportunities are going to get snapped up and you might miss the boat